So what actually is the difference between concurrency and parallelism? So concurrency is the ability of a system to handle multiple tasks at the same time by managing the execution of these tasks. It doesn't necessarily mean that the tasks are running simultaneously. Instead, they can be executed in an interleave manner. And the key idea is that the system can switch between tasks, creating the illusion of simultaneous execution. On a single core CPU, the operating system can switch between different programs. So let's say we have a text editor and a web browser. So here we can see there are two processes which are each given a specific time to execute execute at time quantum and the CPU core can then context switch between the processes and execute the current process and repeat this until both processes are complete. In modern CPU cores the switching happens so fast that to the user it appears as if they are being executed at the same time when in reality they aren't. And so this is useful for IO bound tasks where the CPU can switch to another task while waiting for an IO operation to complete. Parallelism on the other hand involves the simultaneous execution of multiple tasks, which are actually run at the same time on multiple processors or cores. On a multi-core processor, different cores can execute different tasks at the same time. And this is useful for CPU bound tasks that can be divided into smaller subtasks and executed simultaneously to reduce the overall execution time. In this example, we have a multi-core CPU and we are applying a filter to a large image, which is a CPU bound task that can benefit from parallelism. By dividing the image into smaller sections and processing each section simultaneously on different cores, the task is completed faster and more efficiently. And so to recap, concurrency is all about dealing with lots of things at once, but parallelism is about doing lots of things at once. A useful visual for concurrency is to think of a striped line which represents processes being executed in an interleaved manner. And for parallelism, think of two parallel lines, which represents two processes being executed at the same time. I hope this was a clear explanation of the difference between concurrency and parallelism. If you want more in detail technical solutions, make sure to like and subscribe. And also don't forget to check out techprep.app if you want to see the most up-to-date technical interview questions and solutions. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.